So as someone who, who used to compete in these competitions back then, so this year I decided to be a, a judge. So one of the projects that caught my attention is that um, actually the learners that they are trying to solve the problems that we are currently facing now, like energy shortage and also when it comes to water usage. So this um, other project I saw is that um, this learner, she's trying to actually use the waste that they throw away at home and try to actually convert that into electricity. Okay, the project that I'm representing to you is, is there a link between your thinking style and choice of music? My hypothesis, which is the researcher's prediction of what the outcome will be, was there is a link between your thinking style and choice of music. I've proven the statement as it answers my conclusion and I've proven this scientifically. I have found that there is a link between your thinking style and choice of music. I've used 101 respondents. I have 74 graphs and 17 tables. The most enjoyable part of the project was doing the graphs and um, in the research I found that the popular genre was pop. The targeted group was grade 5 learners as the sample size was pop and I used 101 respondents for a, for a re reliable and valid um, responses. It's about water ponds to find back you. So in this project we actually made our own pond using water and putting grass inside it. We were trying to catch bacteria which are in the air. So after 15 days, when we were done doing our project, we took a small sample of that water and we found bacteria inside the water. So that proved that in the air there are actually bacteria. Poaching was a crisis and an issue in South Africa and I wanted just to raise awareness. Because some people they know about it, but they really can't do anything. So if they if they like tell and encourage other people and tell other people what what more can they do, and that's why I just literally chose this topic. So the project's about um, water restrictions and how they affect the growth and health of our plants. Well, we thought it was relevant to today's kind of problems, the drought. And yeah, we just wanted to find a way of how we could solve, like as he said, farmers. Um, so they can use that, like these kind of substances, to help their plants and produce more, uh, more like, like uh, substances and.